دولة الإمارات الشقيقة على دعمها لنا في هذا الظرف وأشكر الشعب الصيني والحكومة الصينية على مؤازرتها للشعب المصري الحقيقة أزمة الكورونا يعني كان فيها نقاط إيجابية كبيرة جدا وكان أهمها وأبرزها هي التضافر والتضامن بين الشعوب وخاصة شعب مصر والصين والإمارات إحنا هذه اللقاحات هي اللي إحنا أجرينا عليها التجارب السريرية وكنت أنا الحمد لله تشرفت أكون أحد المتطوعين فيها ودي لقاح صيني مع شركة ساينو فارم والوكيل والوسيط هو شركة جي فورتي تو الإماراتية بعد ما نجحت التجارب السريرية كان في تطعيم للقاح ده في دولة الإمارات الشقيقة وحصل على The vaccination took place in the United Arab Emirates and we had the final approval and we are receiving the first shipment from the United Arab Emirates, the Chinese vaccine, as we had an agreement on the 4th of December to be receiving the first shipment on a historic day in Egypt as I thank President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi as he is always concerned with the health of the Egyptians and he has always put the health of the Egyptians especially during the coronavirus pandemic as a priority and we are the first African country to be receiving uh, the uh, vaccine from the United Arab Emirates and from China and we thank uh, the brotherly nations of uh, the United Arab Emirates and China and hopefully we will be passing through this crisis together. Thank you very much to everyone. Peace be upon you. I am very happy to be here today in terms of cooperation between Egypt and the United Arab Emirates to be combating the coronavirus pandemic. On this occasion, I express appreciation to the Minister of Health, Dr. Hala Zaid, and the whole health institution in Egypt and the continuous efforts by Egypt to be combating the coronavirus pandemic as we had an experience in terms of having this vaccine. Solidarity and coordination and cooperation as brothers between the United Arab Emirates and Egypt was pivotal to be reaching this step, to be witnessing this historic step through solidarity as we are standing on the same ground in the same place and through this perspective the United Arab Emirates is, is uh, expressing its honor and coordination and cooperation with Egypt to be gifting Egypt with, with this shipment of the vaccine as a present from the United Arab Emirates to Egypt we have been through a lot as the United Arab Emirates and Egypt we have been through a lot of challenges economically and politically so we are working in the same lane through the same path towards the same goal and it is the only way to be coming out of this crisis through the challenges that have faced Egypt and the United Arab Emirates in the past. And finally, we hope that we would be responsible enough to be holding more cooperation and co more coordination to be expressing 
the love and respect that the United Arab Emirates has to Egypt. Peace be upon you once again. Peace be upon you. Peace be upon you to the special thanks to the Minister of Health, Dr. Hale Zaid, and the Emirati Front as well. I am very happy to be here coordinating with the United Arab Emirates and Egypt to be receiving the first shipment to be receiving the first shipment of the vaccine from the United Arab Emirates to Egypt Ting 全力給予幫助。今天晚上中國疫苗來到埃及,支持埃及的抗疫鬥爭就是生動的體現。Under the coordination and uh, the cooperation of uh, the Chinese President Xi Jinping and the Egyptian President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi, we have seen more strides and bigger strides towards cooperation and coordination between China and Egypt, especially in terms of fighting the coronavirus pandemic and the delicate process of combating the coronavirus pandemic. And we did see a message sent by President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi to the Chinese counterpart Xi Jinping. And more specifically, in March, in March, we did see President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi uh, standing beside China. The Minister of Health, Dr. Hale Zay, traveled to China to be aiding China during the coronavirus pandemic. And we did see the pyramids and the other monumental places in Egypt being eliminated with the Chinese flag in a message of support from Egypt to China. Xinjiang主席和塞西总统都强调，啊，中国同非洲人民是好兄弟、好朋友。我们在抗击疫情中团结与共、风雨同舟。我还想说，在今年的第九届中阿部长集会议上，我们共同发表了团结抗疫的联
which is the reception of a shipment from China and the United Arab Emirates to be combating the coronavirus pandemic through the shipment of vaccines to Egypt. And there was a joint statement between China and the Arab countries about the solidarity and the cooperation between the Arab countries and China to be facing up against the coronavirus pandemic. And tonight, we are seeing a step being implemented on the ground, a step being implemented on the ground through the Egyptian Chinese Forum or the Arab Chinese Forum and the statement that was released back then stressing the coordination and the cooperation and the solidarity between the Arab world and China in specific to be defeating the coronavirus pandemic. The Chinese side always wants more cooperation and more coordination and giving help to the other nations in terms of having more vaccines, more effective vaccines. In the upcoming stage, we will be exerting more efforts with the Egyptian side and with the Emirati side to be stressing the coordination and the cooperation between Egypt and the Arab world in general. And this is only a new start between China and the Arab world. The efforts will be bearing fruits in the near future in this field of producing vaccines. We are certain that the solidarity between China and the Arab world will be strengthening the friendship between China and the Arab world in the future. To be walking alone, you will be walking faster, but to be walking together, you will be walking for longer distance, as it is being said in China. And I would like to express appreciation to the results of Egypt, the results of the efforts that were exerted by Egypt under the leadership of President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi and the Prime Minister Dr. Mustafa Madouli and the Minister of Health Dr. Hale Zayed, the efforts that were exerted in the past few months and in the past year during combating the coronavirus pandemic. I would like to appreciate that. And once again, I thank the Egyptian side and I wish more prosperity and more health to the Egyptian people. Thank you very much.
a question asked by a reporter. The shipment being delivered here in Egypt, does this mean that other shipments will be delivered in Egypt? Dr. Hale Zaid, the Minister of Health, is replying by saying that the regulations of the World Health Organization will be asserting uh, the people who will be having the vaccine first, especially the doctors and the nurses and the medical staff and the patients with other diseases or the elderly people. This is the first shipment, but we will be receiving more and more shipments according to the contract that was signed between Egypt and the International Alliance of Vaccines to be having more uh, shipments of the vaccine. The, the vaccine has an efficiency of 96% and it could be reaching 100% in certain cases. The accreditations that we had uh, were related to the emergency situations and we had that accreditation from the World Health Organization following the clinical trials in stage one, two and three. The first stage has a lower number of people having the vaccine Stage 2 has a bigger number of patients and the third stage has tens of thousands of people who have the vaccine and then uh, we see the safety of the vaccine as we are reaching and we did reach the emergency approval of this vaccine as happened in uh, the United Arab Emirates and six other nations had the uh, emergency approval of this vaccine. The United Arab Emirates also said that uh, it had the final approval of this vaccine from the World Health Organization as they have been trying this vaccine for the past six weeks. So they have the final approval and we have the emergency approval of it. And the, it would be for free, as directed by President Assisi.